Good morning friends, welcome to another vlog of Egypt. So today I am having breakfast now at Ramses Hilton Hotel. After which we are proceeding to Alexandria. It's a day trip from Cairo. This is the coffee. It's a cappuccino actually. So I and my mother are all set to go to Alexandria. I have booked this trip from TripAdvisor and it cost me rupees Indian rupees around 8200 which includes transportation but doesn't include food and entrance tickets this is the highway of Egypt it's actually the highway from Cairo to Alexandria this is the desert road as they call it So she is our tour guide for today and she has been with us for all the days of the tour. The car journey from Cairo to Alexandria town takes about three and a half hours around and the distance is about 225 to 230 kilometers. So the highway is super nice mm -hmm. with multiple lanes as you can see. So finally reached Alexandria town. And this is the Marine Drive kind of area. It resembles the Mumbai Marine Drive golden necklace. This is lining the Mediterranean Sea on the right as you can see. So first we are heading towards uh, the library, Alexandria Library, that's the building. So that's the library building. The entry is about 70 Egyptian pounds to go inside. Uh, we didn't go inside, so just roamed around here. The outside area, that's the Alexander statue. After which the city of Alexandria is named. The building is a cylinder building. Okay? A cylinder, okay. And has like, you know, a sloping roof mm -hmm. to allow the sun rise to get in or the sunlight to get in into the reading area on the top on the same spot so there used to be the lighthouse the and the, the fort was built from the same stone of the lighthouse you know so it was built against the turkish invasion then the turkish actually invaded egypt and they used the fort to you know to protect themselves you know so, so the other side of the mediterranean sea is greece and in the north there is Turkey. This is the outside area of the library. And that's the building. Just taking the selfie video mode. This is the road lining the Mediterranean Sea. So after the library visit, we are heading towards the fort. And before that, we want to try the signature Alexandria ice cream. So we are passing by the Mediterranean Sea. You can find such buildings as we pass through this road. It pretty much resembles Mumbai's Marine Drive in India. So came to this restaurant 
called Azza. We are tasting the traditional signature Alexandria ice cream. The cost is 45 Egyptian pounds for one cup like this. So I asked for a combination assortment of ice creams like this. The taste is awesome. And then later came on to this citadel of Kait Boy. That's the fort actually, as you can see. That's the fort and then on the back is the Mediterranean Sea. So you can have the option of climbing all the way onto the stairs there and then you get a sea view. These are the surroundings and this is the aquarium. I didn't go inside, it didn't look very attractive. So after that fort visit, now heading to catacombs of Komel Shokhafa, which is another prominent historical landmark here in Alexandria. These are uh, the very old buildings lining the streets of Alexandria. We just arrived at the catacombs of Komel Shokafa. This is the entry ticket counter. The entry ticket cost is 80 Egyptian pounds for adults. So these catacombs of Komel Shokafa, also known as the Hill of Treasure, regarded as a huge necropolis and royal cemetery that dates back to the 2nd century AD, in fact. So here the stuff we can see around here, mm -hmm. we didn't find them here. We brought them from different spots. Okay. From all over uh, Alexandria. So we come come here. Later. So mm -hmm. you remember during in the museum we saw like you know the coffins there are um, huge. Mm -hmm. And even we didn't see the big ones. We saw the the one is the art, the mix of the art between you know Greek and Roman Egyptian art. This one, the colors, a bit in colors gone, and nothing in there. Okay. Here you can see, like you know, that could be the owner of the ashes inside. You can see the red, the sun disk, Egyptian influence, right? You know, the sun disk, the god Ra, the wings. Mm -hmm. You know, Egyptian influence. Who is the god of protection? It's Egyptian. Here you can see the jackal, the god of the mummification, yeah. right? Yes. You can see the falcon, and you can see here the cobras. The ceiling is Greek Roman. So we will try to mix Greek Roman steps inside, leading inside, 91 steps to go inside to see like three floors underground. This is the map of the catacombs spreading over three floors. The central well, so people used to like uh, rob the dead person, mm -hmm. you know, and lure the dead person by rope, you know, to the So it was made like part of the bedrock. So we're climbing down now. The tour guide is with us. Oh, okay. 
table. Like, you remember I told you, like, Romans, traditions, after yeah. funeral, not, we are not sad, coming, sun, dancing, lighting candles, you know, eating. And we used to bring the food and the clay mm -hmm. or the pottery. Century AD, right? Mm -hmm. For a bright, wealthy Roman family, but after the fourth century became a public one. Okay. That's why we did extensions. So here are the extensions, mm -hmm. you know, for both here, everywhere. Mm -hmm. So here is the main part of the catacomb down here. Let's all come down to this. Or we can, we'll see, we can come up here. We can put. This uh, Muslims and all the brain Here, ashes. Mm -hmm. Here extensions for ashes. Mm -hmm. But the cremation is not down there. Hindus are always cremated. Oh, really? Yeah. So, and then ashes will be collected and uh, dropped into the river. And the Holy rivers. Mm -hmm. The extensions inside. Like, do something with us, like, I don't want to be cremated. Inside, we can see the main coffin, and you can see to be the owner of the ashes inside. Okay. The statue here, you can see like leg forward, this ancient Egyptian influence. Mm -hmm. You can see the wig in the Greek room, you okay. know. So, the, the dress is ancient Egyptian. Here, you can see the same, like the kilt is ancient Egyptian. The features and the wig, it is Greek Roman, you know. See, like the main coffin here. The main coffin, you can see the funeral bed. The f we saw that inside the museum, the funeral bed, remember? Yeah, From mummification, and you, you can see the head sticking chip line. Even so, like the throne of kings, the, the legs sticking chip of uh, the line. And you can see the enormous, they got of mummification in Shushan Art, holding, you know, the holy water for mummification under the funeral bed. If you look here, the other side, it's the same thing. Okay, will you come in shape? Okay. And you can see the people on the both sides here, 100% great people. You can see some of the colors. It's because it used to be painted. The colors used to be painted, but the colors gone. We will start to add extensions here. Horses and their knights. Yeah. So people thought that the place could be around here, like the temple of God's yes. horses and their knights. You know which went in one in the in the races. Okay. We are not sure, mm -hmm. but we found here bones and relics yeah. of horses and their knights okay. inside. Oh, these are. Uh, it could be temples. These for are the bones of horses. Horses yeah. and their knights. You know the knight. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But some, it was an evidence. Like most of them used to be painted. Mm -hmm. So it was really a nice visit to the catacombs of Kamel Shokafa. Got to learn a lot about the ancient history of the cemeteries of Alexandria. And these are the local markets here in Alexandria as we are passing by. These local markets are very crowded, I was told. So now we are heading towards the ancient Roman theater in Alexandria. There is a tram also. Trams also run here. Even now. In certain streets, I believe. Not everywhere. So we arrived at the ancient Roman theater. This is it. The entrance fees was again 80 Egyptian pounds around. So the amphitheater word itself stands for ancient Greek term, which means an open air area. And these were used for performances, in fact. This is the 360 degree view of the Roman amphitheater. So 
So after that brief visit to the amphitheater, we are on our way back to Cairo. We spent about four hours in Alexandria visiting these landmarks. So it will again take about three to three and a half hours to reach Cairo. I booked this trip again from TripAdvisor and cost me around 8000 Indian rupees per person including transport so just arrived back in Cairo now and heading to the hotel so crossing the Nile river now on the Zamalek island this is the Nile river so just uh, came to the Namaste Indian restaurant at Ramses Hilton Hotel and having lunch here just took some rice, dal and amritsari fish tikka so that's all in this vlog folks hope you enjoyed this Alexandria visit see you in the next one and until then take care and thanks for watching